County. A moral member of parliament, Jacob Olanya, may not have it easy in his quest to keep his job as deputy speaker of parliament. Last week, Olanya was given a note by the ruling NRM party's parliamentary caucus to vie as the sole candidate on the party ticket for deputy speaker of the 10th parliament ahead of the elections on 19th May. But now, he may have to fend off Kampala Central MP Mohamed Seriko, who appears to be giving the moral MP a formidable challenge. Efforts by NRM chairman, President Chairman 7, to have Nseriko stand down for Olanya have not yielded fruit. The president reportedly met Nseriko today, and according to some reports, they discussed the deputy speaker race. Nseriko later told NTV he will take on Olanya because they don't stand for the same principles. Whereas all people are candidates, but we do not share similar values in this cause. Several laid out some of what he intends to do if elected deputy speaker. What am I bringing on board that is not there right now? Is there clearly good working condition and cooperation? Then uh, respect for members of parliament. He also feels that members of parliament have not been empowered to effectively represent the people, and that is one of the things that he intends to push. Whereas we are here to serve the public, also respect, for example, of the welfare of members of parliament is paramount. But unequivocally, I would like to also state but with that respect of the voices of the members of parliament both on the floor and outside, is also paramount. Monday afternoon, President Seven held a meeting with all newly elected independent legislators at State House in Tebe. The President reportedly asked the MPs to support Olanya to retain his job as Deputy Speaker. But sources in the meeting say the President seems to have hit a dead end. The sources add that Nserico, who is also an independent MP, told the President that he could not stand down for Olanya since they don't share the same values. Besides, he asked that why the president would push him to stand down for Olanya if the Omoro MP was strong and would easily win the election on 19th May. An independent MP, Jacob Obothoboth, was vying for the deputy speaker's seat and stood down for Olanya. But the other contender, Wilfred Nwagaba of Ndora East, is now backing Nserico. Nserico was an NRM legislator in the Nance parliament. But after a failed attempt by the party to expel him and three others from parliament, he quit the party stood as an independent and retained his Kampala central seat. Maurice Chow, NTV.